take a look at this box. Look at this artwork. Is this not cool or what? Let's get this thing opened up, see what's inside. All right, first and foremost, look at this. Hand drawn clone trooper. Is that not cool or what? Uh, but yeah, this box is from David. Uh, he actually, um, uh, David Schultz. We actually met at Second Chance Toys. Uh, me and Kent were there doing a video. Dave was there and we met and uh, he wanted to send me a box. So based on the messaging that uh, he sent to me, we've been corresponding. He had some doubles of, uh, I guess, troopers. And he said, hey, man, I want to send them to you. So, David, first and foremost, thank you very, very much. And uh, did you draw this? Because if you, that's cool. I, I don't know if I could do that. That's pretty spot on. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to expect. The only thing I know is this is a pretty big box. It says small. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's a big box. Get this thing opened up. Get the old uh, Rule 9 device put back up. I think we got uh, some letterage. Yes. I love letterage. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, hey, Greg, I wanted to reach out and say thank you for the great content and always having a positive attitude. I've been a fan of the channel. For quite some time now, I enjoy when you introduce us viewers to new toy lines and your toy talk segments. I was going through my Black Series collection, decided it was time to thin the legion of troopers. I had amassed over the years. I couldn't think of a better person to send these to. I hope you enjoy the enclosed treasures, and hopefully there's some you don't already have. I actually doubt it, LOL. Uh, you never know. You never know. Um... You have quite a few always on display. Uh, I remember meeting you and Kent, Kent Pool Collects, when you were both recording at my favorite toy store, Second Chance Toys and Collectibles. I'll put links to everything in the description. I appreciated the fact that you took time out and talked toys with us. Like you always say, toys are good for the soul. Take care. Enjoy the troopers, my friend. David Schultz, a.k.a. Grey Goat. T66. Toys are good for the soul. Gave me a little hang tin right there. Check that. Right? That's some good artwork. And, and the signature. Look at that signature. That's like presidential. That's like, you know, awesome signature. Mine looks like a doctor wrote you a prescription. All right, enough chit chat. Let's see what's in here. Oh, right off, right off the bat. Right off the bat, it's it's a good day. Right, I mean, literally right off the bat, we have. Uh, <laughs> I mean, come on, we got the heavy Mando. I love me a heavy Mando. I do have some heavy Mandos. I got three, I think four. This will be number five. That's awesome because I got them all paired up with my Death Watch Trooper. So uh, that's a win. What do we got here? I do not have this one. I do not have this. Outstanding. I've not been able to find this pre. Uh, and this is cool. This is very, very cool. Uh, right there. I've not seen it. This is the first time I've seen this. Uh, I definitely am digging it. And uh, I may have to do a review on this one. Because it's coming out of the box. That's awesome. Very cool. This is going right here. Uh, what do we got here? Uh, uh, I think it's Ar Ara Singh. I, I suck at names. Uh, I do have one of these figures. But now I actually have uh, another one. Which is very, very nice. Because I think this is a cool figure. I really did like this figure. Um, it just, I don't know. It looks, it just looks different and let me know in the comments, but the arms actually look longer. 
So that's sort of what made me think about this figure when it when I first saw it. Man, look at this. I mean, look at this. Oh my goodness. Uh, and I do like the fact that they're they're all like this. So I don't really know what they are. So I'm just gonna grab in. I'm gonna reposition this a little bit. Boom, who we got? Ooh, Flame Tropra. Ooh, this is a cool one. Um, I don't. I only think I have like one of these. I like this one. I really did the Flame Trooper. Uh, that's very very nice. Uh, I'm not even looking. I'm just reaching in and grabbing. <laughs> Panda Baba. I do not have one of these. That is very very cool. It's a very interesting uh, figure and character. Uh, you know, he's a thug. Just say it. He's a thug. I like it. Let's see, I'm going over on this side of the box. Let me grab the tab. What do we got? Oh, security droid. I do have some of these. You can never have too many droids. David, boom. That's a good one right there. Uh, I do like I do like droids. Droids are awesome. All right, grab this box. Ooh, gaming great, uh, Rocket Trooper. I do have some Rocket Troopers. Um, again, it's a trooper. You can never have too many troopers. I'm a I'm a trooper addict. So uh, yeah, it's a trooper. It's a win. That's all I got to say about that. Back here to the back. What do we got? Oh, IG. Okay. I have an IG, but I wanted to get another one, but I, I just, I missed out on it. So this is awesome. This is very, very cool. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and since this will be the one that I definitely do not ever unbox because I already got one and he's unboxed. Let's go to this side of the box. Oh yeah, <laughs> boss, another great figure right here. Um, I do have the boss figure and this is very, very cool. I do not, I only have the one, so I'm super stoked for this. I love the weathering and stuff on this. They, they did a really good job on this figure. And I actually have some 3D files of this armor uh, that, that I've done some printing on. All right, what's this one? Oh, wait a minute. I do not have one of these. I do not have a snow trooper officer. And I'll tell you the reason why I don't have one. I never picked one of these up for one reason and one reason only. I personally feel like that this figure only works if you have snow. Just saying. I don't get snow in my area. Like literally do not get snow. So uh, yeah, I just never picked it up. But David, thank you so much. I now have a snow trooper and he will be put into the special collection. And if I ever do get any reasonable amount of snow, I'm unboxing this and I'm gonna do some photos with it. Promise. Let's go back to the back of the box. Oh yes, right here, Scout Trooper. Um, I do have uh, I do have a couple of these, so I'm, I like this figure. I like this figure a lot. Um, the Scout Trooper is not my favorite trooper, but I did like this one, and it was because of the accessories and just the way it looked. Uh, even though he does have a really tiny blaster, so that's that's a win right there for sure. What's this one? Ooh. Oh, what is that? Ooh, Night Brother. I love the Night Brother. I do have a Night Brother. Um, mine is unboxed, uh, but he's very, very cool. Uh, I, this is probably one of my favorites uh, when it comes to uh, this type of, uh, you know, Darth Maul type figure. I like the, I like the yellow and stuff. So that's just cool. This is very, very cool. It's got an awesome weapon too. So heck yeah. I'm 
I'm, I'm, I'm still. I'm, I'm, what is this? Commander Blah. Another awesome figure. What again? A favorite of mine, I, and I love the paint, uh, the detailing, and everything on this. Uh, top notch, wonderful figure. Uh, I really, really dig this one. I like it. Yes, Commander Blah. <sighs> we still got a few in the box. This is amazing. Oh, okay. So, Range Trooper. I have one Range Trooper, okay? And this is another one that I feel like, um, you know, cold weather, like this, like with the, uh, the Snow Trooper. This figure, though, I really did enjoy this figure, uh, or this character. Uh, I think the Range Trooper was a very, very nice, different uh, approach. Uh, so I dig this one. That's the reason why I picked one up. Uh, I've never took, took mine out of the box just because it doesn't snow, but I, I appreciated this figure a lot. And the helmet really, really was digging that. So nice. What's this one? Oh, heck yeah. Oh, heck yeah. Death Trooper. Cannot go wrong with Death Troopers. Not going to lie. I got, a, I got a squad of these, and I don't find them anymore in my area. And I have different variants of it. So anytime I see a Death Trooper, I definitely pick it up. David, boom. That definitely will be unboxed. He's going with the other ones. 110%. Oh, this is a, this is a new slanted box. What is this one? I don't have this one. I do not have the Flame Trooper. Gaming greats. I don't even know if I ever saw this in my area, to tell you the truth. I, I don't I don't know. I don't recall. Uh, and if, I, if it was in my area, it was for a very, very small window. The one thing about this figure, though, that I feel like it needs, it needs to be dirtied up. It needs to have some, like, soot and stuff because he's a Flame Trooper. He's shooting out flames. So this one, this one may become a custom. I may, I may, I may actually do a custom on that one. This is another uh, of the new uh, angled boxes. Oh, bam, bib. I do not have a bib. Bib is not one of my favorite characters. Uh, I know that may trigger some people. I appreciate bib. Um, but like I always said, I'm a Troopers guy, okay? I don't have a lot of non-Trooper Black Series figures. So, um, David, this right here is awesome because now I'm going to have one of these to open up and check it out. I mean, it's a cool figure. Don't get me wrong. It, it's a cool concept. The figure is good. The, the, it looks good. Detail, all that looks great on it. It's just I'm a Trooper guy. I can't help it. Okay, we're getting close. We're getting close to the end. Another square box. Oh, yes. This right here, the Imperial Jump Trooper. When these first came out, I actually bought, um, I think, three of them. And I did a photo shoot with th all three of them uh, up in a construction area where they're, they're taking off. And I used some wire and stuff. Um, but yeah, it's on my it's on my Instagram, Facebook, all that stuff. But yeah, this is this is a fun one. I I really did like like this one. So yes. Okay, we got one. We got two left. Another square box. Oh man, I never found one of these. Never the the actual carbonized stormtrooper. I wanted one and I never, I never got one. Bam. This is awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's amazing. All right. Last one. Another angled, another angled box. What could it be? Trooper or non-trooper? It's an angled box. I'm going to go with non-trooper. 
I was wrong. Oh yes, the Jet Trooper. This is another one that I did not pick up. I did not pick it up. This is awesome. I dig it. I think the you know the the Jet Troopers. I mean they're they're awesome. I love the Jet the Jet Troopers. So uh, yeah, this is amazing. This is awesome. Let's check this out. Let's line these things up. Take a look at this awesomeness that uh, David hooked me up with. I don't even know if we can get it all in the shot. This is awesome. Slide that over. Let's get one of these square ones here. We're, yeah, it's, it's getting there. We're getting there. Boom. A smart person would have probably done a cutaway and came back and already had this all set up, but you know, hey, I don't claim to be the sharpest knife in the in the uh, in the drawer, but uh, oh man, this is this is crazy, David. Man, I don't even know how to begin to say thank you. I don't even begin to say. I, I don't know if I can say thank you enough. Uh, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20 figures. And there's a, there's a, a, a decent percentage of them I don't have. So David, home run to you, my friend. This one right here though, that one's getting a review video. Cause that bad boy is not staying in the box. So, uh, yeah, that's awesome. But yeah. You're right, a lot of these figures I do have, and that's okay because I like to army build, squad build, whatever you want to call it. I like doing that. I mean, come on, I've got a hundred Death Watch Troopers. Yeah. <laughs> I like to army build, just saying. So, <clears throat> but anyway, guys, give David a big shout out. I'll definitely leave links. Um, I'll find uh, the social media stuff, put that in the description. I'll put Second Chance Toys in the description as well. I'll put my buddy Kent Pool in there. All great, 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 great people. Um, if you've never been to Second Chance Toys, I highly recommend it. David, I really hope we, uh, we meet again. Uh, it was really fun talking to you. Thanks for the messages. Uh, and, you know, speaking of that, if you want to reach out to me, feel free. Uh, I'll have links to all of my social media in the description of every video. You can find whatever medium you want to, uh, you know, hit me up. We'll talk about whatever you want to talk about. Toys, 3D printing, cosplay, it does not matter. We'll talk about motorcycles. We'll talk about magnificent. I don't care. If you just want to chat, just want to say hi, feel free. I'd love to uh, get to know you. So, yeah. Toy community is awesome. It rocks, and I enjoy it immensely. So, Definitely check out the descriptions. If this is your first time on my channel, if you enjoy my content, do me a favor, consider hitting that subscribe button. If you do subscribe though, make sure and turn notifications on. That way you'll know when I drop videos, which typically I try to do the videos at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, five days a week. Um, here lately, I've, some videos I've only been able to do like two or three a week, and that's just because of work and travel. But uh, I try to give you guys at least, uh, I try to do the five a week and uh, live stream. So uh, yeah, but you're not going to know when I do it unless you turn on notifications. And finally, please always remember, toys refreshes your soul. And I'll see you next time. <laughs>